I've recently been getting a bunch of questions on Gremlo. How do I install mods on Foxel? Gremlo, am I gonna get a virus if I install mods from HIO? And I'm here to show you guys how to do that uh, in a safe way. Again, everything that I'm showing you is stuff that I've done personally for my own version of Foxhole. You've seen me mod uh, before using the improved map mod and another mod which I'll be showing you how to install since that's the most requested uh, mod people have been asking for me to show them to install. Basically the same uh, steps that I'm going to go over are applicable to all the mods you see on this page. So links to everything will be in the description below. Um, first things first, before we even get to how to install mods, I want to direct you guys over to the Discord community that handles all of these Foxhole mods. If you have questions about how any of these mods work, or you want to talk to some of the creators on the mods, consider checking them out using the Discord link in the description. So let's begin. If you click on the link in the description, it'll take you to itch.io showing you the Foxhole tagged game mods. The mod we're going to be going over and I'm going to show you how to install is, of course, the Shirtless Foxhole mod. This is a fan favorite of mine, as you know, but uh, the steps to install them are all the same. So the first step here being when you find a mod you like, you click into it. There's going to be information about the mod itself. There's going to be information about any updates to the mod and as well as uh, download buttons for your mod packs. Um, it's important you read all these because like here in the mod overview section, it will tell you what each of the downloads uh, actually do. So M underscore torso will add shirtless models for colonial warden and male slash female variants. And then this Z M torso MF only is compatible with other mods. Don't keep the torso mod, which is the one above, if using this one. Me personally, I only use the top mod. Uh, last time I tried using this M torso one, it didn't really work too well. Uh, the models look a little janky, so sometimes it can be a bit of plug and play. But again, don't worry about uh, breaking anything in Foxhole. If something's not working, you can just uninstall and reinstall the game. Everything will be fine. But uh, if you follow the directions the first time, you should be able to install this mod, no problem. In this case, we're installing M Torso. Reason being is because this other one has already been tried and it doesn't really work, at least for me. So let's click download now and you might get an option to donate. If you feel like donating, consider donating to the mod maker. I'm gonna click no thanks because I am a cheap bastard and we are gonna go ahead and download the mod pack. After the mod pack is finished installing, you're gonna to go to Steam and click on the cog wheel towards the right of your foxhole screen and you will go ahead and click manage and browse local files. Once you've clicked browse local files, that'll open up file manager for you here. You will then click on the war folder content, packs, and you'll see a bunch of different packs here. Uh, yours may look different from mine. I have a few other mods installed right now, but if you open up your downloads folder and take the mod pack and drag it in there, you should have that mod now installed for Voxel. And as you can see, your boy has his shirtless mod pack installed. We also have the female variant next to me here. Uh, but that's how you install mod packs into Foxel. Again, all these mods are safe to use. I've installed multiple mods at the same time. But again, if you have any questions, feel free to reach out to the mod makers themselves in the Discord linked below. Hopefully this was helpful for you all, and I'll see you all in the next one. If I spooge all on the couch, would you still open up your mouth? Cause I got way more coming out all on your body